Hello there, kids, and it's I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, and when we left off, we were at the sink trying to drop off a couple things. I'm down to three gold bards left on my inventory. I've gotten rid of some of the excess, and at this point, I figured I might as well install some implants because they don't count against the endurance total that you can get. So, um, I'm thinking maybe get... Y7, because that one seems useful in hardcore mode, especially. Alright, gonna get that, there we go. Bonus HP and AP from food. If you're Could've used to that stay before while, I got into the Sierra Madre, but hey. Alright, sounds good to me. Uh, let me turn down my volume on my headset a little bit, it's a little too loud. Alright, and we're going to get another one. Install implants. I think I'm going to do, for this one, drinking radiation removed. But then again, increased speed while crouched is actually very useful. I think I'm going to do that one. For the time being. Just that one. Okay, he's apparently talking in the sleep again, so that's not a good sign if he's doing implants on me. He's got a severe case of shoe lung. Of shoe lung. Okay, I have a feeling that might be your fault. Alrighty, I'm still overburdened, but that's to be expected considering I... I still have three gold bars on my person, and I have all the essentials I really need. Now for my weapon loadout. I said I might be looking into a couple things, and I did. I did pick up the medicine stick while, uh, in the last episode, but I figure I might not need it right away. But at the same time, it is a very powerful gun. As you can see, the damage is 119. And the DPS is not necessarily that high, but that damage output pretty much overbears any armor I can really run into outside of power armor. That said, the survivalist rifle, not really that good when it comes to that. It's a, about of a mid-range weapon, same as the medicine stick, without a s scope on it, really. And uh, while the DPS is extremely high with this one, that really makes it more of a uh, mid mid armor destroyer, really. While this one can take pretty much anything that can be thrown at it. And I considered for a long time possibly trading out the carbine for it. Because the carbine is pretty much not even close in all respects. Look at the DPS there and the damage with the upgraded, you know, ammo and compared to the medicine stick and its ammo doing far more. The problem is this one also has a scope so if I get rid of this I lose most of my long range capability. But then again I can overcome that by using the survivalist rifle and medicine stick in tandem and then if they get too close I can always fall to the little devil or a light shining in the darkness or if worse comes to worse the Tommy's gun. So what I'm going to do is probably get rid of the trail carbine because what I gain from this pretty much overrides anything that I have in this. So I'm just going to get rid of that now. Once I get all the way to the safe, I probably should have been doing that while I was talking. But hindsight is 2020. I'm going to move my chair a little bit away from the microphone. There we go. And get to the safe. There we are. Whoops, that's the wrong button. I wanted this. There we go. And drop that and the ammo for it in here. Now, I could be giving this ammo to someone who would be using it if I gave the weapon to someone, like for say Cass. But I think she's pretty good with Lucky as it stands. Lucky has a pretty decent damage output. I already have a bunch of ammo on her already. So I'm just going to be dropping all this ammo here and just going to keep her running with Lucky as it stands. That said, all of my stuff that I really wanted to do is pretty much done and over with. Just trying to figure out where I put everything. Got medicine sticks over here. Uh, survivalist rifles over there. Katana's over here. Little Devil over here. Light shining in the darkness is over there. And the Tommy's gun is right over here. Now. Now that I have all of that set up, more or less, I'm going to... Uh, which one should I switch to? This one. There we go. I'm going to get out of here. 
Actually, I just realized I need to have the uh, trans transportal ponder. That's a really big mouthful. That is not even a word. Uh, <laughs> not even a goddamn word. Are you kidding me? Anyway, I'm going to have to pop that out so that way I can head out and try and drop off the rest of my stuff, which should take a long while. That said, I have no idea where I should drop it off because I've basically hit every spot on the map. I've hit the Mojave Outpost. I'm pretty sure uh, we hit... Nipton isn't even a place anymore. Um, <laughs> we've hit Novak. We've hit... Uh, yeah, we're vilified with Cottonwood Cove, so there's no point going over there. We've hit Camp Forlorn. I don't remember hitting Camp Forlorn Hope. That's weird. Uh, we hit the 88, 188 trading post. I'm trying to remember all of it as I'm going along, but then I'm looking at new stuff so that I haven't been at in a while. Um, that's... Oh, boy. <laughs> this is going to take forever and a half to get through all of them. We are not going with the Crimson Caravan, because fuck them. Uh, we've hit the medical clinic to get implants. We hit the uh, gun runners and... Really, the only other place we haven't gone through is the uh, is the strip, really. But uh, there's not really a lot of places we can drop off those gold bars in the strip, so it's almost not even worth trying to go there. Um, who should we really talk to? Is what I'm thinking. Because we still have three gold bars on our person. Uh. I'm thinking Good Springs. I'm thinking Good Springs might be a good last stop. Because I'm pretty sure that Chet should have a couple of things that we might need. Eh, might. Key phrase. Oh, I was about to drink my coffee, but then it decided to load quickly for once. Okay, pop this. There we are. We're good. And no one's outside. No one. That's weird. Maybe it's just a load thing. Might be. Okay. Let's head into the general store. Good gods, this takes forever and a half. I should swap to a one-handed. I'm a little faster. There we go. Oh, jeez. All right, there we go. Am I carrying a lot of ammo? Yes, I feel I should be carrying a lot more ammo than I usually carry. Because, you know what? I might as well. All righty. Hey there, Jet. You looking to buy some supplies? Kind of. Kinda, sorta. Uh, Can do. You know, just selling you shit. Hey, you have a lot of caps. How about that? Alright, I'll take these. I'll take these. I can break them down. I'll take these, because why not? I'll take those too. Um, <laughs> I'm just taking everything you got there, buddy. Um, I don't really need those, per se. Then again, it wouldn't hurt. Uh... How many cases do I have of anything else? Not a lot, I don't think. I'm pretty sure I ran through all those. Um, let's sell you one of these preemptively, because I know I'm eventually going to get you down to that point. Um, I might as well take the 9mm too, just to get the stuff from there. I'll take these, I'll take those, that'll work. Um, I might as well take these just to break them down. So I have the powder and the lead. Um, made a lot of doctor's bags, so I don't really think I need more. So I'll leave that alone. Uh, uh, okay. I have no idea what else to buy from you. Buddy, you, you, you don't have a lot. You don't have a lot here. It's not really helping me or you in any regard. Ah, uh, jeez. Yeast. I was thinking of doing Cass's Moonshine at least once, and we do need yeast for that, and we do also need a fission battery, but at the same time, that is a lot of weight I don't want to be carrying. I'll just take that. Oh, jeez, you do not have enough for my shit that I need to get. Jesus, you don't have enough even if I take all your stim packs. God damn. A recharger rifle, that is absolutely worthless when it comes out of you. Jeez. No. <laughs> Not at all. Gods. Okay. Um, can I get oh, burned books out of you so I can bring them? Yeah, I could. I could 
bring them to the sink eventually <laughs> and then make blank books out of them. That'll take a while because I'll still be overburdened as all hell at that point. Um, yeah, burn book, destroy book, ruin book, scorch book. And you still do not have enough caps for me to sell you that shit. My God. Someone save me <laughs> from this overabundance of caps that I now need to get that no one seems to be carrying ever. Oh, boy. Um. Fuck a duck. <laughs> How am I supposed to get rid of this? Just, like, at a complete loss at this point? Is that all I have to do? Because that's the only option I have, and I don't want to be getting rid of it at a complete loss. Well, not a complete loss. More like 20 to 15%. But still, I don't want to do that if I can avoid it. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I did not plan this ahead of time. So this is now all on my head at this point. Ah, Jesus. Horatio. Hubert Christ. Um... Hmm. That might be a way to get it. There we go. Oh, dear God. Give me a shout if you need anything else. I am now Take more overburdened than I was before with stuff that I barely need. <laughs> and now I'm st still stuck with two more bars. God damn it. How am I supposed to get rid of this? Oh, I did not plan this this far ahead. Maybe I could go to Prim. Maybe that's a uh, place I could do stuff with. I'm going to drink my coffee now. And shut the hell up while I try and plot out ahead. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, I was like, what the hell is that? It's like a tumbleweed lifting up into the sky. No, that's smoke. That's fine, then. Oh, boy. I hope that I will be able to go into the Mojave Express and do that thing. Because, God's damn, if I cannot sell it anywhere else, I'm going to throw a goddamn fit. Ah, yay, my dehydration increased. Yay, that's exactly what I fucking needed. Ah, okay, where's purified water? There we go. And it's now decreased. Yay. Alright, someone be in here so I can sell shit. Yay! Thank you. Hey there, youngster. Hey there, old person. Jesus. Uh, you have anything for sale? Things are pretty good with Myers watching over us. I can give you a little bit of a discount. Oh, really? Really? Okay. That's good, I guess. Exactly what I was hoping for, but okay. <laughs> um, take those because you have them. Uh, take these because you have them. Holy shit, you had a lot. Um, good gods, I'm going to need to take enough so that way it actually justifies me selling <laughs> gold bar to you. And I can't even justify that at this point. I'm almost halfway through your inventory and I can't justify it. Oh my gods. What am I supposed to do with all the shit that I have on my person? Uh, God damn it. Take those and those. At least justify it somewhat. Jeez. Uh, <laughs> you don't have enough. You don't have enough. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Uh, uh, fuck it. I'll sell you the other thing I bought that I didn't need. For fucking. Do I. Where is it? Where would it go? That's what I want to know. Uh, that'd be in miscellaneous, I think. Yeah. Power Fist Ported Chambers. I'll sell you that. How about that? Huh? There we go. Get rid of that that I barely had room for. For more bullshit. God. Pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, but. I have some questions about your robot. That beat up old thing? Yeah. What do you want to know? Where did it come from? A courier dropped it off a couple of months back. I got it working for a little while, but the darn thing pooped out. 
Well, I haven't been able to get it up and running again. I was hoping to use it for some courier work, but <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. Apparently not, no. Uh, what's wrong with it? Hell if I know. I don't think it's serious, but my tinkering days are long gone. Okay, my phone just beeped twice for some reason. I have no idea why. Uh, do you mind if I try to fix it? Are you welcome to try? It's yours if you can get it working. Oh, nice! If I had my way, I'd dump it in the scrapyard in Novak and be done with the damn thing. Well, fair enough. That is a good point. Um, goodbye. Don't go getting yourself shot. Wasn't my plan, at least not currently, but now I'm starting to wonder. Anyway, damaged robot. This is an advanced model robot with a reinforced frame. It is well weathered and appears to have seen a good bit of action. There is very little in the way of serious damage. Uh, let's look at what the uh, problem is then. Examine the electronics, because we have enough science skill now, I think. A uh, few of the primary electronic systems seem to be fully functional, and the redundant systems are all working. If you bypass some of the primary systems, the secondary systems should compensate and make some of the repairs easier. Uh, run the bypass. Alrighty, that works. With the redundant systems compensating for the damaged primary circuitry, many of the gyroscopes begin spinning. Uh, the repair doesn't look like it'll be too complicated now. Oh, that lowers the repair necess the uh, repair check skill thing. That's what it does. Okay, that makes sense. It was like at 60 before, wasn't it? Or something high up like that? So yeah, let's try to repair it. There we go. I mean, I didn't need to do that. I could have just repaired it outright, but that works. Whoa, what the hell are you doing up on the ceiling? Companion protocol, begin. Hey, so all of these are weirdly done in science stuff, or science uh, logic codes. So anyway, uh, oh, I can have him make some ammo and access multi-tools. Oh, so he's like basically a floating toolbox that I can use stuff with. That is awesome to know. Okay, I do not need to make... Uh, Sierra Madre uh, chips right now. I was using the fission battery for a different thing. So, um, I couldn't get ammo out of him, though. Um, no, where's the uh, talk to? There it goes. Um, I'd like to make some ammo. Oh, awesome, I can do that. Hell yeah. Um, make some of those. I, I need to talk to him for everyone. Oh, God. This is going to take forever and a half. This is not ideal ever. Okay, there we go. Alright, and make some ammo. Uh, now I have to break down things. Oh, gods. Here we go. <laughs> Here comes the pain. Oh, gods. I'll, I'll make some of this just to get it out of the way. Oh, great. That didn't cover anything. Fantastic. What do I need, then? Uh, I need cases. That's all I need. Okay. Alright. Fine. I'll just leave it alone, then. I'm good on everything else, just need cases. I'll eventually get to that point, but right now I'm trying to get rid of the shit that I have and I can't do that with the shit the way it is. What the? Why is there an enemy over here? What? The Everlong fuck was that? But yeah, what is this? What is this enemy sitting here for? Was there people I missed? Was there... Was there raiders I missed in the, uh... Casino here? Maybe. But those explosions were a little more concerning than anything else, but... Whatever. Alright, well, um... <laughs> that's said and done. Oh, jeez. Again, more explosions. Great, that's exactly what I want to hear. Ah, uh, Nipton... Fucking... Wolfhorn Ranch... Oh, there's a thing there that I eventually need to show, but, uh, kinda can't do that right now because I am overburdened as shit! Uh, Novak, I've already been there. I've already been there. I've dropped shit off. I can't drop any more shit off if I could try. Uh, Gibson Scrapyard. Uh, what is that about? Why do I have a quest there? Uh, bring Eddie to the Gibson Scrapyard in Novak. Oh! It's for Eddie. Okay. I could do that, but, uh, um, I'd rather try and drop off the shit. Do I have to go to Camp McCarran? Do I have to? Do I have to? Because that's the only other place I can think of that would have enough stuff for me to sell off. I'm going to have to do it, aren't I? Shit! Fuck. 
Okay. I did not want to have to do that, because I don't want to have anything more to do with the NCR. Because at this point, I'm trying to run with Yes Man. But, since they're the only other people that seem to have enough resources to buy what I'm selling, and enough resources that I can get back what I'm selling to them, gonna have to go to Camp McCarran. Damn it. Alright, well, what we have to do to turn a profit, so we're gonna turn a profit, and we're gonna end the episode here for right now, because this is going to take forever and a half to get over to the fucking guy I need to talk to. Okay, is there any enemies nearby? No. Good on that. Alright. Just make it sure, just on the off chance. Why does it... Why can't I be in the middle of the Camp McCarran fucking airfield? Why can't I be in the middle of it? Ugh, it's going to take forever and a half. Okay. I'm going to end the episode here for right now. I'm going to come back once I'm done selling shit because god damn this is going to take a century <laughs> or more just getting there so thank you all so much for watching click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video and share in comments so we can bring more people into this community we can talk about the game for playing together and i will see you all in the next video where hopefully we're doing something other than selling shit this has been the one the only stray cat playing games and just trying to get stuff moving for you.